This is an ABC 10 News update. Hello, I'm Jim Patton with this ABC 10 News update. Several parts of the county seeing flooded streets after heavy rain rolled through overnight. This is video from Chula Vista, and you can see cars splashing through those roads. Rescue crews are keeping an eye on areas prone to heavy flooding like Mission Valley. The rain comes as California is dealing with a severe drought. Governor Newsom has signed an executive order to pull us out of it. The calls on local water suppliers to move to level two of their water conservation plans. This includes restrictions on outdoor watering and targeting and reduction in water use. This has been the driest first three months of a year in California's recorded history. Well, county Supervisor Chairman Nathan Fletcher will give his second state of the county address this week. Supervisor Fletcher says he will focus on homelessness, housing, mental health, public safety and more. Last year, Chair Fletcher delivered the annual address from the county's COVID-19 supply warehouse. This year, the speech will be delivered from San Diego Continuing Education Center, and that is in Mountain View. Right now, let's get a check on our weather as it seems like the rain clouds have pretty much passed at this point. That's right. Yeah, only a very slim chance for any more raindrops the rest of today. The best chance will be near the mountain area as the worst of the storm has pushed out, though the cool air lingers low to mid 60s for the coast, 40s in the mountains with 70s in the deserts. In fact, temperatures trending 5 to 15 degrees below normal today, and the cool air actually lingers through Thursday when we could see another slight chance for a little rain, but anything on Thursday, little to no accumulation is expected and then we'll be drying out and warming up as we head into the end of the work week. Jim. Megan, thank you very much. And for the latest news, weather and traffic, go to 10news.com or download our free 10 News app in your app store. For ABC 10 News, I'm Jim Patton.